Good Wednesday morning, Glads. I'm Hannah Hall. And I'm Ethan Simon, and this is your KWHS News. Here's the latest news from the Counseling Center. The college visit lineup continues next week with these schools. Pikes Peak Community College will be here on Wednesday, February 7th, followed by Fort Hayes State on Tuesday, February 13th. Colorado Mesa will be here on Valentine's Day, and UCCS plans to be here on Thursday, February 15th. The Adams State reps would love to chat with you on Thursday, February 22nd. Then visit with the reps from Lamar Community College on Friday, February 23rd. And finally, on Monday, February 26th, the reps from Barbizon Modeling and Acting School will be in the Lower Commons during lunch to chat with you about their school program. Seniors interested in attending PPCC in the fall, stop by the Counseling Center to sign up for PPCC's application date on Thursday, February 15th, 2018. The PPCC reps will be here to help you fill out the application. They will be back on Wednesday, April 11th to help you with registration. Freshmen, sophomores, and juniors, cosmetology classes are coming to WHS next year. If you are interested in these classes, be sure to stop by the Counseling Center and add your name to the list. Seniors, the panoramic photo is next week on Tuesday, February 6th at 7 a.m. in Bowers Gym. If you haven't purchased your senior class shirt yet, you can still get one in the Counseling Center for $15. Get yours today and wear it next week. And remember, seniors, send your photos to Curie Carmody's email to have them included in the yearbook or the senior slideshow. Photos must be of seniors only. If you've dropped the ball and need to make up failed credits to graduate on time, credit recovery is for you, and registration is open now. The spring session starts on February 12th, so you should get registered now. To register, go to the District Programs page on the WSD3.org site, select High School Credit Recovery, and get started recovering those credits. There will be a mandatory orientation for credit recovery on February 12th at 3.30 p.m. in the WHS cafeteria. At this orientation, you will meet your CR teacher and receive your access code so you can take your pretest. If you cannot attend this orientation, you cannot start your session courses. Please see Ms. Dykus for more information. Coming up, we are checking with Ms. Betsy and for the lunch menu for today and tomorrow. Happy Wednesday, everybody. Today we're having super nachos with all the goodies. So come on down and see us. And then on tomorrow, Thursday, we're having chili. It's supposed to be a cold one. Thanks, and have a great day. Bye-bye. Thanks, Miss Betsy. Students, remember to add money to your lunch account by going online or seeing Miss Betsy in the cafeteria. When we come back, we'll have club news. But first, we're throwing it to Kieran Doolittle for our Gladiator Sports update. It's Rivalry Wednesday, Glads. I'm Kieran Doolittle with your Gladiator Sports Update. Spring sports will start practices on February 26th. With that said, if you need to pick up a yellow card to play, those will be available in the main office on February 12th. Remember, you need to have a current physical on file and a yellow card to participate. If you missed the baseball meeting on Monday night, please check with Ms. Miles in the athletic director's office for that information. Hey yo, those of you interested in the ultimate frisbee team, Mr. Nell will be holding this informational meeting on Friday at lunch in room four. If you cannot make it, please see Mr. Nell for team details. The Rocky Mountain Color Guard Association is having its first competition this Saturday at Mesa Ridge High School. Our WHS Color Guard will be competing at 4.36 p.m. Cost to attend is $5 for students with ID and $10 for adults. Our forensics team is headed to a competition this Friday and Saturday at Discovery Canyon campus. Good luck to all those participants. We'll have results for you on Monday. From the NJROTC desk, cadets, the military ball is quickly approaching. If you plan to bring an outside guest, mark your calendars because those forms will be available starting on February 14th and will be due by March 1st. We will bring you additional details as the ball gets closer. The wrestling team is headed to league championships this Saturday in Canyon City. If you can make 
make it down to support our gladiator grapplers, they would appreciate your support. In swimming news, our ladies were in a dual match on Monday night at Fountain Fort Carson, and they're looking strong for league championships. Our ladies jump back into the pool this Friday and Saturday at Cheyenne Mountain for those races. Be sure to join us on Friday when Doc will talk about snow and ice on the health tip of the week. Although, we haven't had much of either lately. We hear the weather is changing tomorrow, so stay tuned. And finally, in case you haven't heard, we have a basketball doubleheader tonight against the Purple School. Our Lady Glads take the court at 6 p.m. and the boys will play at 7.30. We want everyone to be there, so whatever your plans are, scrap them and join us as we rock Bowers Gym. Remember, it's a blue out game, so wear your best gladiator gear. If you cannot make it tonight, no worries. We'll have scores for you on Friday, but you really want to catch these games firsthand. Let's pack the house. See you there. That's it for our Gladiator Sports Update. Go Glads! Beat Mesa! Have a great week. I'm Kieran Doolittle. Now back to you, Hannah and Ethan. Thanks, Kieran. Since we're in scheduling mode, there are several really great opportunities available for next year. Here is some information for your consideration. First, KWHS wants you. Applications are available in room 102 if you would like to join our staff. See Ms. Snoop soon because applications are due this Friday, February 2nd. For those of you who picked up a yearbook application, those are due to Ms. Kennedy in room 104 today. <coughs> Sophomores and juniors, the teacher cadet applications are available in room 202 from Ms. Ship. Time is running out, so get your application in quickly. Renaissance applications are now available on the school wires page. Everyone is eligible to apply this time, including freshmen. All applications are due next Wednesday, February 7th, to Miss Sardinia in room 130, no later than 3 p.m. She will not take any late applications, so be sure to check with her if you need more information. Just a few reminders. Scheduling cards for juniors are due tomorrow. Student Union is open again in the library every afternoon from 3 to 4.15. Be sure you have a sticker on your ID. The lost and found bin in the business office is growing. Please come check to see if any of those items are yours. Any items not claimed will be donated. Any student interested in competing in the Xi Pi Annual All-City High School Step, Dance, and Talent Hunt, please see Mr. Washington in room 115 for details and entry information. They welcome individual and group dancers, musicians, vocalists, and thespians. The Talent Showcase will be on March 3rd at Pikes Peak Community College. Cash prizes will be awarded for first, second, and third places. Students and teachers, golden tickets are coming soon. Teachers, remember to hand out your golden ticket to that one student among all of your students who deserve it. Students, if you get a golden ticket, remember to put it in one of the boxes for your chance to win some very cool prizes. Prizes will be drawn at the assembly on February 27th. Attention, NJROTC cadets. The military ball is right around the corner. As we get more news, we'll keep you in the loop. For now, ladies, you might want to start making those appointments to check out the dresses in Becca's closet. We heard they just got some new inventory. See HK in the library or Miss Molina in room 111 to make those appointments. And finally, remember Glads, today is a blue out day for the rival basketball game. If you dressed up in your gladiator gear with your face painted, drop by Miss Melton's room. That's room 103 before 7th hour today to be entered in a drawing for tickets to the games tonight. Winners will be announced at the end of the day. Good luck. We'd like to wish both of our basketball teams good luck tonight. Come on, Glads! Beat Mesa! Go Glads! Beat Mesa! Woo! Go Glads! Beat Mesa! Glad to be Mason. Go 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 Glad to be Mason. That's all for our news today. See you at the game. I'm Hannah Hall. And I'm Ethan Simon. And from your KWHS news crew. Go Glad to be Mason.